Hey guys, I wanted to share with you how I wet the paper. So there's been so many questions. I got so many questions, messages, and overall in comments, people would ask me, how do I wet the paper? Like, why is it staying wet longer? And what do I do? So I have all this time to apply the paint and the paper hasn't dried yet. Like I continue working like three minutes already, like five minutes and the paper is still wet. So what do I do? How I do it? I do this to have a very nice and smooth sky because whenever your paper starts to dry before you're done applying colors wet on wet and let's say one corner of the paper starts to dry you are in the risk of causing a bloom and blooms are not a bad thing they're not but the thing is that whenever you're trying to paint a smooth sky, for example, and then the paper's drying on the left side, then what do you do? Do you just continue going? Well, that's when you're gonna have a bloom or you're going to create hard edges. So this is what I do. I take my time wetting the paper. So in this section, I'm going to use a flat brush. This is a flat brush heritage series by Princeton, one inch size. Overall, I prefer softer brushes to wet the paper. And as you see, I'm not shy with water. Another thing is how I tape that washi tape. The washi tape, it holds my paper, but only by the corners. There's nothing, the tape doesn't glue the paper towards the table so my paper can breathe basically so you can put fingers right underneath the paper here and let the water even go there although i don't do this purposely it just naturally just the water goes in there that's the thing the water just goes under the paper sometimes but the thing is that i keep wetting that paper i keep adding the water i keep dripping that water over the paper and i go so many times i go back and forth from left to right left to right left to right and i do this for two minutes sometimes three minutes for the most part is between a minute and a half and two minutes i really go a lot over the paper with that wet brush this is a three-quarter size so i'm changing the brush here so this is a three quarter size heritage series and I decided to add some colors for the smooth background. So I switched to a smaller size for a little more control overall. And this is how you can create a very nice and smooth sky or any background, whatever you're painting, a landscape. You wetted that paper for so long and you massage that paper basically with water that now you have that time to apply the colors you want. You don't have to stress about the paper to start drying on one side or some other area. So as you see, my paper stays wet. It's wet. And then the thing is that even if areas start to dry, because I work the entire paper all at once, I continue wetting that paper. So I keep it moist, like I keep it wet. So that's another thing I always like get asked about, like how do I continue like painting for so long when let's say your paper is already dry because I move so much over the paper. Like it's like a map. I go from one side to the other side and so on. But that's one way to do it. Like this is how you can keep your paper wet longer just by taking your time wetting it take your time and do it for a couple minutes thanks guys mm -hmm.